Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the second. So let's just see what comes up. Now, keep in mind, not every reading is for you. Take what resonates and leave the rest. And the timing is fluid, right? We're going to see if I can get all reversals. Just kidding. That was a joke. What do we have for a message today? Knight of Swords. So very fast moving energy. Things are gonna something's gonna happen. Could be sudden, could happen very, very fast. There could be a sudden arrival, sudden departure, blunt, direct, honest communication could be coming through. Queen of Coins. So we have somebody here that is very uh, nurturing. This person seems to have something of value in their hands. I mean, this this is uh, this Queen of Pentacles has a golden opportunity in her hand. I mean, that is something solid. So a stable. There's an opportunity for stability and security. Somebody is coming in very, very, very fast. This Queen of Pentacles is very hardworking, very devoid, devoted, very loyal, has a lot to offer, right? I mean, she does. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius right here. Now, that could be sun, moon, rising signs, either one. Anyway, whoever this person is, looks like they have stability they have something of value this is something you can take to the bank right this is something you can touch and hold on to and keep this is somebody that is very devoted and very independent and hard working so somebody is, is headed in very abundant energy here down to earth as well Five of Swords. Now, the Five of Swords is a battle of some sort, conflict. Somebody is, is, is battling, or they're wanting to battle, or they're wanting to fight. Somebody may, may be wanting to fight for something. They have something they want to prove, or something they want to say. It could be something they want to say. There is some sort of... Uh, action that is being taken put it that way it could bring conflict because fives are a number of conflict this is somebody that is ready to fight they are they're ready to fight or they're ready to do something they want to win this is somebody who wants to win they're definitely taking action putting some plan that they came up with into action oh my god ten of cups Go figure. Ten of cups. So whoever this person that is coming in is probably looking for happily ever after. I mean, the ten of cups, looking for abundance. You know, we got somebody here that is looking for, you know, a permanent love or they're looking for happiness. We got somebody that is headed in and they want happiness and they see an opportunity with somebody that is stable. This person is stable. They are solid. They are secure. They are devoted. They are loyal. They are hardworking. They are down to earth. This person um, has a lot to offer, right? We've been talking about the Queen of Pentacles here. Uh, this person is very sensual. And this is somebody that is on a mission. This person is on, there's no stopping them. They want this opportunity for happiness. They definitely do. They see an opportunity for happiness and they're going for the opportunity for happiness. This is definitely putting a plan in action. They want to win. They want to win at all costs. So this is somebody, there's no stopping this person. They don't have any fear. Get out of my way. <laughs> 
magician reverse acting on impulse without thinking i do believe there is somebody there here that may be doing something without you know really thinking you know the magician reversed is powerless you know it's a powerless individual that may act impulsively action without thought okay we could have somebody here that is totally unplanned this is unplanned it's uh I don't know. Magician reverse can be a master manipulator. Somebody may have, uh, this person wants to win at all costs. I think that when you get the magician reverse, you got to be careful. There could be some manipulation here. We may have somebody that has hidden agendas. There could be an arrival. Somebody's coming in. They're coming in hard and fast. They may say that. This is be careful. It is be careful. Okay, they may say they want happiness, they may say they want forever, or something like that, but when you get magician reverse, that is like, that's some sort of manipulation. There could be lies, there could be, uh, you know, I've been hearing sirens all day. We could have a trickster here. We could definitely have a trickster here, somebody that has some tricks up their sleeves. They may see some that somebody has some money, you know, and they want that money. Just be careful. Be really careful. What is that magician reverse? Let's find out. The magician reverse can be a lack of action as well. So, I mean, this queen of pentacles may be holding on to her money or holding on to her stability, not taking any action, not doing anything, you know. This is not doing anything, not just holding on. You get a pen, looks like she's holding on pretty good to her stability, not giving it away to anybody. That'd be the wisest thing to do. Anyway, King of Swords. So this is somebody that is very intelligent. We have somebody here that is extremely intelligent, very decisive, knows what they want. This person knows what they want and they definitely see an opportunity for happiness and abundance. This magician reverse is really getting me. This is like, this is a tricky situation. It is a very tricky situation. This person knows what they want, has thought about it, and this is not thinking about it. Interesting. King of Swords usually thinks very, very logical, very sharp, very intelligent, very honest, very truthful very to the point somebody is going to be receiving some direct communication from an individual that they probably maybe they didn't think this is actually they didn't think they were going to hear from or that could be the case um what the hell is this magician reverse that's like that's no communication it is no communication this person's very stable has a lot to offer has not been receiving any communication from somebody or there hasn't been any action, this person, is this is a decision maker. So I believe there's some challenging information that is coming or some challenging communication. This is a challenge. This is a conflict. So I do believe that somebody's going to be receiving a message. It's going to come out of nowhere. It's going to come in very fast, very suddenly. Okay, this could even be an arrival. Somebody just arrives. But anyway, there's going to be some some sort of fast moving energy here we got somebody here that wants to win they are ready to fight they see an opportunity for happiness this is a huge opportunity this person is very capable okay but that magician reverse is lack of communication lack of awareness very very tricky so <laughs> what is this magician reverse one more time No communication. That's what I want to say. There's been no communication. Maybe this person is so solid, so independent, so stable. They're not communicating, right? Anyhow, um, this whoever this person is does have an opportunity for happiness. Eight of not putting in effort. So I do believe we have somebody here that is very... Uh, secure. I mean, the Queen of Pentacles is secure. This per whoever this Queen of Pentacles is, she's not putting in any effort. She's not doing anything, not working, not putting any effort into it. You know, just holding on to her own. Pretty happy with where she's at by the looks of things. 
totally unaware because the magician reverse is unaware as well unaware that somebody is coming in Ugh. this person is uh, in a position a very powerful position this person is is they're ready this person is ready they know what they want and there ain't no stopping this guy I mean, the King of Swords is somebody that is very cool, uses their head. This is definitely somebody who has planned something. Oh, boy. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, by the looks of things. We have Gemini a, couple, a few times. Um, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well not putting in effort somebody's not putting or they haven't put any in any effort not trying hard enough no communication there's been no communication not putting in effort this queen of pentacles has so much to offer i mean that's a huge opportunity this person is coming in i mean that knight of swords is get out of my way or you will get hurt by the looks of things That, that is that is impulsive behavior. It's interesting because the King of Pentacles usually thinks very, very logical, but this is very impulsive. Somebody may have missed an opportunity, or they don't want to miss an op opportunity. There could be some unfinished business here. Somebody may have done something foolish, or they, or they could do something foolish. Um, now, you got to be careful. You've got to be careful. Now, be careful is part of this message. We could have somebody here that is doing something foolish. Okay, they're doing something really, really foolish. Maybe they're, they're struggling financially. Somebody could be struggling financially and they're, they're, they want, they don't care who they hurt. They don't care who they hurt and they're uh, after somebody's money. So I would just be really, really careful. We do have a master manipulator here. I don't care what anybody says. We do have that may be struggling financially and it feels like they may do something well i think they've planned it but I, it's interesting i think that they've planned it but i think it's foolish and reckless and impulsive so it's interesting that they've planned it but i still feel like it's stupid it's a stupid move <laughs> it is it is i feel i feel like somebody's doing something stupid anyhow um or they may think that somebody's stupid they may not be aware that somebody is very wise okay because this is both these lack of awareness so we may have somebody here who thinks that they are so smart that they are going to dupe somebody they may not be aware that we have somebody here that is very wise okay <laughs> full reversed so that's headed for a fall we have somebody here that is headed for a fall they may they may not be able to get what they thought they were going to get. Okay, because this is this is lack of manifestation. It's no answer. No. Yeah, no. So somebody may be thinking that, you know, they're gonna be going down a path with somebody. They may be thinking that they're gonna have this fresh start or this new beginning, and the answer is no. Okay, the answer could absolutely be no. It could be, you know, that'd be foolish. That'd be stupid. You know, especially if it comes to money. <laughs> that ain't gonna work out. I mean, if you're asking the Queen of Pentacles for money, you better have a damn good reason for that. Just saying. Anyhow, um, so there is somebody that is, is going to be making a an entrance this person is and it doesn't have to be a lover it could be anybody this is somebody that is probably dealing with some conflict of their own or they're dealing with some challenges or they're struggling with that five of swords this person is going to be making some sort of move they want fulfillment right they're looking for fulfillment they're looking for security in some way because it feels like wherever they've been, it hasn't been working out. Something hasn't been working out. Maybe a job didn't work out or a relationship didn't work out. Somebody may have been in a, in a, in a relationship that didn't work out, you know, and they were foolish. 
They made a foolish, stupid mistake. And now they're going to be, you know, this is somebody that acts with integrity and is, is ready to fight and face the truth. So somebody, that could be for some of you. I mean, I know the story is changing. Well, we got, what, thousands, like, what, 15,000, 14,000 people that watch this? There is somebody here that is going to be making a decision after they have made a foolish choice, okay? They have, were unaware. They were unaware of somebody's abundance. They were unaware, unaware of somebody's value. And now they are coming in with a hurry, in a hurry. This is in a hurry. And I feel like they are probably, um, you know, this is somebody that is letting go of fear. They were in a place of fear before, but I don't think they have any fear anymore. I see fearless. This person is fearless. It's like, I know what I want and I'm going to get it. So get out of my way. You know, that's what it feels like to me. Somebody may have acted with impulse and impulsively in the past, you know, and that didn't work out. Now they've, now they know what they want. I mean, the King of Swords is somebody that is very intelligent and wise that has some sort of wisdom, has gained wisdom. This is a decision maker. He's going to do it. It's like, I'm going to, I got to do what I got to do. This person is on a mission. Definitely on a mission. You better get, he better get a move on. Let me tell you that. Ah, right over the queen of pentacles reverse, the nine of wands reverse, facing some challenges. So we got somebody here that has been avoiding challenge. This person uh, may have a chip on their shoulder. You know, they've been repeating negative patterns. And they always want to have their own way. And they have a lot of pride. So I do believe we have somebody here that is... It's almost like they were, they were fighting something and they're giving up their stance. You know, they're, they're ready. They're ready to just back down from... Whatever it is that they were trying to prove. I think we have somebody here that is angry as well. With a magician reversed right next to that nine of wands reversed. They're angry that they missed an opportunity because of stubbornness. Trying to prove something. And it's really trying to prove something. Right here, somebody was trying to prove something. They've missed an opportunity. This is a missed opportunity. There could be some unfinished business. Um, foolish, foolish pride, huh? Foolish pride. Another love lost up to foolish pride, right? Anyhow, so yeah, I think that somebody has uh, realized something. I feel like we have an epiphany here. I gotta, gotta go. I gotta go. Anyway, and this doesn't, I, I just, I, for some of you, it could be somebody new. Could be somebody brand new. I mean, the Knight of Swords is a sudden arrival, a sudden departure, an entrance of some sort that comes very, very fast. Something comes rushing in. It comes out of nowhere. Okay, this is somebody that is throwing themselves. They are throwing themselves into the heart of a situation. It's like, you know what? Get out of my way. This is what I want. And I know that I've repeated myself, but you, you know I always do. So anyhow, they want happiness. They want something permanent. They want something stable. And they've been angry about all the, all the challenges that life has thrown them. And I feel like they had a barrier up. And now they're letting their barrier down. Because whatever, they, whatever foolish mistake that they made by acting impulsively didn't work out or isn't working out. And now they're making a move and they are moving in a hurry. So I feel like on this day somebody is going to be receiving some sort of challenging information.
from an individual that is trying to act with integrity. This person has gotten some sort of in epiphany, okay, or an awakening or something like that. And now they know what they want. For some of you, there could be some upcoming legal matters, okay? And I know I'm changing the story again. We have a fight here. We have a fight. could be a family fight, okay? We, there could be a family fight here. Somebody does something stupid. They do something impulsive, you know, and the law gets called. Just saying. And did we hear sirens in this reading? I think we did. I don't know. I've been hearing them all day. Anyhow, uh... So there could be some, you know, the law could get involved. If we got somebody here that's acting stupid, doing something impulsively, they're angry about what life has handed them. They don't, they don't have a job or they don't have any money or something, or a relationship didn't work out, you know, and they, you know, I'm just saying, law could get called. But, um, on the bottom of the deck, we have a two of cups. Two of cups is a union. It is a partnership. It is a getting together. It is, um... A love connection okay so I do believe that somebody is going to be getting an offer and I feel like it is has to do with a partnership that you know somebody wants a partnership they want a union they want to get together they want to unite okay um, very fast moving energy this is somebody that is definitely looking for a permanent love and they are coming in extremely fast good luck <laughs>